upstairs. <laughs> I can't afford it. That's, that's a nice. And I've only got till midnight to get my hands on that formula. All right, let them in. Clean them up, make them presentable. Take them to the west wing. And no, take them to the east wing. The wind is from the west. <laughs> Don't keep an eye on Yoko. Make sure he doesn't know they're here. Right. You, call the police. Tell them I want a squad of men discreetly placed around the grounds. But an intrusive, you hear me? I don't want to embarrass my guests. Yes, sir. General, you're not really serious about letting those miserable hillbillies into your home, are you? Young lady, you've got to expect this kind of thing these days. There's no limit to what you have to do to get your hands on a measly couple of billion dollars. But what if it should be seen? Think of your dignity. Dignity? <laughs> it's the thing fast. Vanderbilt, Astor, Rockefeller, they, they can afford dignity. They didn't have to go through all this modern-day nonsense, all these new pagan progressive ideas. Social security, old-age pensions, filtered cigarettes. Well, I told them, but they wouldn't listen. I said, you put a radical like Herbert Hoover in the White House. <laughs> and they call it progress. <laughs> Thank you. 